Okay guys, quick tip from the Rexer show. I'm going to show you how to access your arcade menu in FBA or MAME. If you're like me and you love playing on MAME and FBA emulators and you think there's no substitute, then you're going to want to access this menu to access certain options such as game difficulty or speed of the game. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to access those arcade menu options. Just like when an arcade tech would open up the coin door and go in and put free play or change the difficulty. This is the same settings that you can access through RetroArch. So let's get started. I'm going to show you how to do that using an example of Super Street Fighter 2. And we're going to turn the turbo up all the way to 4 in one of these ROMs. So we're going to launch the game. We're going to get through the warning messages. We're going to start it and I'm going to show you what it looks like when you just play it normally. So there's no option like you might see in other consoles, uh, classic consoles, where it shows uh, slow, medium, fast, and you get to pick a one, two, three. That option isn't available in these arcade ROMs. And you'll see it shows speed turbo one at the bottom. And then you play it and it's, it's normal speed. Um, but we want to turn that up. We want to see if we can get this thing going a little faster. Here's how you do that. We're going to enter our RetroArch menu with the uh, select X key in uh, RetroPie, uh, RetroArch. And we're going to go to Quick Menu, down to Options. And we're going to look at our diagnostic input. Now again, I'm in an FBA ROM here. And this is launching RetroArch through FBA Alpha, or through Final Burn Alpha 2012. My particular setting shows hold start to access the diagnostic input. Your setting may be different. It may say none, may say something like start plus A plus B. I'm going to leave it on hold start. I'm comfortable with this, although it is easily accessible by someone who doesn't know what they're doing in the middle of a game and launching the test menu. So if you make a change, you're going to want to go to configurations and push save, config, save current configuration. We're going to go back to the game and all we're going to do is we're going to hold start and bingo, the test menu, uh, AKA Diag's menu, um, arcade options menu has been launched. And the option we're going to go to, although there's plenty of different, uh, menu options here. We're going to launch the system configuration and on my key, my pad it's the X key. You can see game difficulty on easy. One coin equals one credit. We're going to go down to game speed. We're going to turn it up to you got one, two, three and free select. Free select is what you see on many of the other arcade or uh, classic consoles. We're going to hit the start button to save as we exit and then we're going to go down to exit and hit the X button. We're going to restart, and now you see one, two, three. I'm going to put it on fast. It says turbo three, and you see the guys are a little bit faster. It's not, it's not that much faster in this, in this uh, particular, but they are faster. Um, there's a couple different uh, consoles and games. Uh, Super Street Fighter games where you can get much faster action. I'm going to show you that in another video uh, with, with a console that's super fast. So I told you I'd get you to super uh, or to turbo equals four. I'm going to exit out of I'm going to exit out of here. And in order to get that, you're going to need to have the Japan edition of Street Fighter uh, Two Turbo. Uh, it's basically the same game, but in Japan they launched it as Grandmaster Challenge. Uh, this is a MAME version, so I'm going to show you the difference in MAME 2 when launching the arcade test menu. Uh, I'm going to launch this game. We're going to go through the warning messages. And in MAME, as I said, it's a little different. If we go to Quick Menu and Options, we don't have that diagnostic input in that setting. Uh, but the good news is, is that I know that to launch it initially, it's going to be the F2 key on a keyboard. So I have my keyboard here. I'm going to go back into the game and I'm going to press F2 and 
Bingo, same test menu. We're going to go down to system configuration. We're going to go down to game speed. And we got turbo one, two, three, and four. And then free select. I'm going to put it on turbo four. Exit out. And you would think that this game is going really fast on Turbo 4. Not really. It's almost the same as the other one. But you can test it and see what you think, whether it's a little bit faster or not. Seems like it might be a little bit faster. It's a slow fireball, fast fireball. So to me it's about the same, but we did get turbo equals four. And we got Ryu. All right, stay tuned for my next video or subscribe. I'm gonna show you a Super Street Fighter edition that is super fast. Unfortunately, not playable on the Raspberry Pi, uh, but I'll show you how it works uh, in my next video. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope this helped.